What's good, family? It is your boy, Ma. And Shade, and we're back at it again with another video with everybody's mom. God, dog. <clears throat> I'm over here getting choked up. Uh, today, guys, I'm ready to most slides the daily beef between NBA young boy Fredo Bay. Man, this man have not dropped the video in almost about two months, and this it was a series we had going. We was watching it. I, I can't remember the last thing we that we talked about. Well, that he that long? yes. This story it been it been that long since he dropped the video. It been like a month or like going on two months. It don't seem like it. It's been a minute since he he even dropped the little series that everybody was into. Mm. But other than that, man, let's get into this, man. See what the, see most slides talking about, man. AK Fed slides. <laughs> this story takes place in September 2017, shortly after the passing of G Money, and the rumor is NBA Youngboy was behind it. This former friendship went completely sour. Young boy and his crew start relentlessly dissing G Money, causing his beef to escalate to new levels. A war was brewing in Baton Rouge that was gonna have devastating consequences. TBG's upcoming artist, Lil Yoshi, aka the Grim Reaper of Baton Rouge, is working on furthering his own music career. While these two main artists, Boulevard Quick and Fredo Bang, are in prison, just receiving the news of G Money's passing. A prison where OG33 was, aka the man whose family raised young boy since they were little. They grew up in the same house. Young boy and three three were like brothers to each other. In the corner of Boulevard Quick, once the news about G Money hit, he did this to three three. G ain't just that, you know what I'm saying? I'm fucked up. Three three in the dorm with me. That morning, I walked up to his bed, woke him up, punched him in his shit. He shitted on himself, checked out, told the people he cannot be around me or Fredo Bang. He was in prison. They couldn't do it. I did not know that. Yeah, me I did not see that's crazy. Like you only hear like really one side of like yeah one side and that's NBA young boy. So you don't ever hear like really the other side of story. Right. Um uh, the young boy, so they took it out on the next best option. But OG33 gets released soon after. And young boy starts sending messages to his enemies in his music, saying niggas want smoke, but he's not scared. And dropping direct disses to his ops and songs like war with us. But young boy quickly falls back on the dissent, which likely has something to do with police being hot on his trail for G Money's murder. And also partially because he had no one to go back and forth with, since TBG's biggest artist was locked up. Young boy was laying low, chasing the more mainstream sound, and it seemed like he forgot about his ops. He rarely acknowledged them online for the next few months, but all this quickly changed yeah, yeah. after the next body dropped in his feud. A few months later, Boulevard Quick got out that same prison OG33 just got out of, where Fredo Bang was still locked up at. It seemed like he was laying low. He didn't release any music off rip, he was handling his own shit. And shortly after his release, Young boy's manager got hit up by his child at home. He was chilling by his car and had his girl beside him. When a car drove by letting off shots, hitting him and his girl. Break the beast of my nigga, big up, I miss you, I just wish I was there. And I'm so smart, I wanna cry right now. Instead of asking God why he took you out of my life. Came to from the start, you pissed me off, I knocked your mans off. He hit the news, we celebrated like a lottery. You know we push it in the grave for playing games, bitch. He pull on sides to whip his spike for who he came with. Cut him with that bitch and tried to leave him with that stain coat. That bitch pull on sides to whip and put him down. Whoa, you caught it? Uh-huh. Yo, like, that's what I'm saying, like. Then you be fine, I said that you, I thought he just died by himself. Yeah. I didn't know he his girlfriend. Well, she didn't, I don't think she's dead. I didn't know his girlfriend was with him. Like, y'all just know, did y'all know this stuff in the comments? Because a lot of this stuff I don't be knowing. It's like they be going back in time and be, right. doing a federal agent case. Like, they the one out there. Yeah, okay. <laughs> this person did that. I'm gonna pick your nigga up. Don't die with an F A. His gun was still in his pocket. That boy deserved to die. He went out there. He put his own gun. You ever had to send a hit behind a jail phone? I told him don't shit hit him in the face. Cause that's the best way. Left him slumped under the car. He had his pistol. Take it. I, I had that glizzy. I was slanging at that nigga. He try to run, but you can't dodge him. They gon' hit you. Drink so on your face so and we gon' fucking get you. I'ma get you to the wrong and I just laugh on my ID. Call them niggas and I said retaliation to mine. They cross that line and they show me that they won't do it. Until they die, swear they ain't got no money with it. You see those cockies on my door, I'ma lay down low. Until the police give me life, I'ma knock some bitches out. Hey, what niggas they know that it's up, nigga? We know he's not staying out of jail. Yeah, he ain't. Right. He said yeah. he ain't stopping until they get him white. So we know he gonna keep doing what he doing until he's he dead or in jail. Pretty much. That's crazy. Like, our generation just, like... Wow, We man. really don't care. Like, either, like, like, like you said, like, either you go kill me or I'm gonna keep doing what I'm doing until y'all give me life. Yeah. 
Every time the issue was on young boy's mind, this was the first and only time he name dropped in this song. That song never dropped. Somebody leaked it. It was never supposed to drop. They leaked it. That song was never ever supposed to drop or nothing. Well, it's not even drop. It's a somebody leaked the song, so that's how everybody knew he said that about him. Huh? Retaliation was on young boy's mind. This was the first and only time he name dropped G Money since his death. Saying he's gonna do the same thing to the niggas that took dump as he did to G Money. An internet detective pinned his body on Boulevard Quick and Lit Yoshi. The dude I said was the Grim Reaper of Baton Rouge earlier in this video. People believe Lit Yoshi played a part in it for a few reasons, but mainly because he damn near admits to it in every song. The sparkle what went down in the first person. If there wasn't a beat behind it, his songs would just be confessions. And people think Boulevard Quick played a part in it too, because of some damning young boy lyrics we're going to get into later. But let's refocus. It's shortly after the death of NBA Dump, and Fredo Bang is finally coming out from prison. He was locked up with this whole story until this point. He went in that prison cool with young boy, but came home to a war zone. While he was locked up, G Money's beef with Youngboy started, eventually leading to casualties on both sides. He came home having to pick up the pieces. When he finally came home, Layoshi took the backseat from rapping, while Fredo Bang and Boulevard quick put TVG on their back, teaming up in an attempt to take over the rap game, breaking up millions of views, and using their songs to send messages to Youngboy. The tables flipped, and me and Youngboy and his crew were clowning G Money, but now it was TVG's turn to laugh. And remember before when I told you that Youngboy was falling back on the dissing? Well, Dump Death changed all of this, and in the months that followed, you will see this war reigniting the music. You bitches don't want war with us. Yeah. I'm screaming, who want war with us? So we want war. So when that song came out, we didn't even, we were just singing the song. Yeah, like, we, we didn't he, know the story behind it. Like, yeah, we, we were literally just singing the song. Story. And it's crazy, he's the same age as us. Yes. That's what really means. Like, he was the same age. We weren't really thinking about it. I know, I was it. thinking about that early when I was listening to his music. And I was like, we really growing up with dude. Like, dude, you know what I'm the saying? Same like, he's the same age as us. Like, that's crazy. Like, I would do it. Where you going war? I thought he was talking about some random people. Like, even like, who won war with us? Like, I ain't know he was talking about them. Right. Y'all let us know in the comments. Well, a lot of y'all will say y'all knew that. But y'all let us know if y'all if y'all didn't know, like, he was talking about, like, this specific person. And I don't know. It's just, it's just crazy. Home game, I just want to sue. I'm sorry. He like, who won war with us? And I'm like, what is doing? You know I'm with the move. Me. Say about him, um, using his, his beat. beat, yeah. But that little you niggas put it down, do nothing but talk. So when we get you, we gon' stretch you, we gon' close your fucking mouth. Don't come fast, nigga, that's cabin ass, nigga. I'm gonna finish out some song, no good rapping ass, nigga. I can beat my whole bike, that's on my name. I'm gonna kill him. Tell that pussy nigga, pick his casket, cause your mother's boy. Won't make her this, I won't say shit. Now, where I'm wrong, talk, nigga, say that I'm gonna get it. Some niggas from my side. Money must be counterfeit. You drop the bag, mom still breathing. I got breath in my back. Bitch, fuck that pussy ass nigga that shot that naked mom. Bitch ass nigga, pull up. You niggas cowards. Man, I got taste the bone this fucking bad. Nigga, I won't see TBG with nothing because we are going to be a real fucking threat to society. They inviting niggas to kill them and talking to them because they didn't do it yet. This beef got worse than anybody could have imagined. It started off as a disagreement between two friends and went way out of hand. These are only a few of the disses. I literally don't have time to show you all of them. They were constantly dissing in songs and going on each other's dead homies. This beef even escalated to the point where Youngboy's mom got involved, getting in a beef with Boulevard Quick herself. Yeah, fuck Fredo Rain and fuck Boulevard Slow. <laughs> Tell me, bitch, keep my name out of my And hey, keep my pattern name out of my mouth. Fuck Fuck nobody said you was a man. Man, bitch. Come on, man. <laughs> but have y'all noticed that, like, Fredo Bang never, I mean, he probably had been on that, like, live, and, but he ain't really just, like, how move out quick. It don't like, be him saying it. Yeah, like, naming it. Yeah, it, yeah, like it don't. Name. It really don't. It always be. 
his, his somebody man yeah, or yeah. like somebody associated with him that's on that's on live doing something yeah. Talking about fuck Fredo Bain, fuck Bullet Boy, slow, fuck you. Fuck my mama. I ain't see that nigga. A joke, huh? Boy, 10 that big and old. Don't miss my rap life my, with my music life. I know, man. He said, don't miss my rap life with my music <laughs> life. You know, you know, he, he you know, you know, you know, you was mad. Mm -hmm. Mix. My rap life, my with my music life. I am pure pussy. Three weeks later, Boulevard Quick was found dead by his apartment around midnight. Niggas ran up on him shooting. They took off running into the woods. Baton Rouge police say the local. Come on, he died. Yeah, outside of his Damn. Damn. He died. <laughs> he died recently, like he died like 2019. I don't remember. He died like early 2019. Dang. I think we might have been freshman in college. Yeah, we were like freshman. Well, he died, yeah. The rapper was shot and killed at his home after midnight. So I heard about six shots go off. I wasn't able to see the guy, but I saw him take off running. Just last year, a rapper who went by the name G-Money was also shot to death. Wells is now the second rapper from his record label who has been killed. I've been knocking niggas up, they never know it was gonna come to this. I dropped that bag, back the bag, that other boy was talking shit, but nigga, look what done had to be. Where cash at you niggas that signed me? That nigga died, cause that fat bitch had a more more. Don't bump on my mom, I ain't wanna talk, I end up killing the man. Hey. Shoot me this shit just like the last girl. Say, as much as he don't get along with his mama, he do not let people. Talk about, talk about mm -hmm. his mama. I don't care what nobody say. He might, they might not get along all the time, but he is not gonna let nobody say nothing about his mama without Ooh. doing something, saying something. True. Mm -hmm. He said we twinned them in caskets. Mm -hmm. He said, "Do you know your time?" He said, "Cause that fat B had a motor mouth." <laughs> right. Yep. Wait, what? My mama ain't want to talk. I end up killing the man. Shoot me this shit just like the last gorilla, nigga. Yeah. He won't win his pole. Another body dropped in his feud. Boulevard Quick passed three weeks after dissing him was mom. And G Money died two weeks after dropping industry. NBA was up again. They got retaliation for dumb. And they took this opportunity of viciously clowning they ops. But all of these bodies dropping was just bringing more and more unwanted attention. Three days after Boulevard Quick's death, Baton Rouge police announced they were investigating this rap beef as a motive for his murder. They were already putting pieces of this puzzle together. The violence kept getting... Chain. I'm sorry, y'all keep stopping me. But they had a chains on and stuff. So, you know, like, I think that's what be making police, like, connect stuff. Because, you know, they all wear chains. They be saying certain like, things. Yeah, so, all geez. you got to do is associate this person with this person. Be like, oh, they wear the same chain. Blah, blah, blah. Then you figure out NBA young boy go by NBA. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it really don't be that hard to... Then, then they rap league don't make it no yeah, better. Yeah, right. <laughs> make it no... It'll make it no better. <laughs> and that's crazy that um, they were talking about in the comment section on one of the videos about Florida. They said Florida police can't use it against you. Right. They did oh. say that. They can't use, like, lyrics against you in court or nothing like that. And that's crazy. Now, that's really some crazy stuff. I think I think that's why Florida rappers say the stuff they say because you can't can't be held against you. Yeah. Worse, they even started crossing state lines. This was no longer a war in Baton Rouge. They were tracking down the ops around the country in assassination attempts. This is what happens when you have a multi-millionaire and someone with damn near that amount of money constantly trying to get at each other. We gonna talk about that and the violence that ensued in my next video. But that's it for this video. I'm most sizing I'm out. Yeah, most likely you're not gonna drop another video to another five months. Get on your job, bro. Wasn't one of his, wasn't one of his, um, when young boy got taken to jail, wasn't he in Florida at first? Or oh. where he was at? Oh. Just recently, where he was at? California. Oh, okay, California. Yeah, he was in Cali. He was in Cali. This is in Cali at his house, and they follow him. Okay. Out of his house, yeah. Man, y'all just know what y'all think about this. I know a lot of y'all, yeah, I know y'all both sides and stuff like that. One person this side, this person that side. I mean, at the end of the day, we are neither side. We are not in the beef. We like both sides' music, so we really don't care. We just reacting to it because y'all asked us to. But other than that, man, y'all already know what to do, man. Please. Like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, subscribe to all three channels, all three channels, all three channels. Man, and follow me and show they both on Instagram, man. Free young boy at the thing, man. I need some more music, bro. Free that man because I need to hear some more music. <laughs> but other than that, man, we out of here.